Oh, look who's calling. You're not upset anymore. I'm still upset. You can't risk your life just because. You know, it wasn't just because. It was to protect you. I can protect myself. Mm, I know, but... Anyway, I'm going to the Louvre, near where the Akuma is. I need your help to fight it. Where are you? Mm, that's... Chad? It'll take me a while to get there, milady. What? Wait, again? Yes, her again. Hmm. Ah, uh, I'm not Emma, I'm Emilio. That doesn't work with me. Don't you know who I married? What are you doing here? You should be with your grandparents. I came to help you fight the Akuma. Princess, we already told you that if we need your help for the battles, we'll come and get you. But until then, you must be a good girl and stay safe. If you're in danger, you won't be able to come and get me to help you. D don't tell me you love her. And what if I do? Damn it, I shouldn't have let Mother find it out. I don't understand. I thought that everything you did was on the behalf of our plan for the... Th for what? Did you really think that I did all this to become a king? Ugh. That the sole reason I was kind and thoughtful with her, and even offering my help in the process was, so she could fall for me and eventually renounce the throne and hand it over to me? I told you way before the wedding that I would never do such thing to her. Not even for my family's sake. You're a fool then. <sighs> Have you forgot already what I've been telling you for years? You can't let your emotions get back at you because people will use it for their advantage. And now look at you. All she needed was a little smile to wrap you around her fingers. You obviously can't think clearly, but let me tell you, she's not the innocent girl you think she is. Ugh, <sighs> I don't want to hear anything you're about to say. Hm, really? Does that mean you don't care if I say that she's been unfaithful to you all this time? Not this, mother, just not this. <clears throat> I don't believe you. Not even if I tell you what my people found out about her. Did you know, for instance, that she often spends long hours in her old suite, while unknown voices streaming out as if she wasn't alone. I believe it can belong to a certain nobleman from the South Kingdom who seemed to be really close to her. One would think they were even having an affair. I guess you know who I'm talking about. <sighs> Enough, mother! And there was another quite interesting thing my people noticed. This can't be true! Uh, I trust Marinette. If she claims that there was nothing between her and that blue head, then it is the truth. That she not even once was seen with no other man but Chat Noir on our balcony. Uh, what? How, how did Mother find that out? <laughs> Finally, I got him. According to my sources, she and that black cat was often spotted at her balcony where... <sighs> Let's say they acted very cozy with each other if you know what I mean. I don't believe a word you say. I know Marinette and I trust her. I've already said several times before to stop this. Stop badmouthing her. Stop following her every move. She is the future queen of this realm. Therefore, no matter your title or your privilege in this palace, you have to face the same consequences as everyone else who is to commit high treason. You have my words, mother. <gasps> how? How dare you speak with me and- You heard me. If you're unable to endure the mere thought of us, then there's no point of continuing this discussion. I'm sorry for not being the son you've always wished for, but one day, I hope you'll accept me and my decisions the way they are. <sighs> the princess must be pretty impatient by now. I better hurry back and forget this conversation. <sighs> An hour ago. You're the first thing that I could be happy about today. The feeling is mutual, darling. <laughs> so, how is she doing? Not so pleased after I informed her about a thing or two that I've noticed recently regarding the royals. <sighs> Although she still holds on to the belief that the prince would eventually follow her orders. She's about to have a conversation with him nonetheless. But I know it'll be to no avail. That idiot is head over heels for that irksome girl. I saw that in my own eyes. <sighs> Just as I thought then. I told her right at the beginning that we should have chosen another way to assume authority. It should have been a piece of cake. But now we must take drastic actions if we want to succeed, considering that once that girl ascends the throne, we're doomed. Had it not been for the prince, I've already taken care of that stupid brat. Hey, honey, don't worry. You know that your time will come over the throne is ours. For the time being, you must be patient. I hate that I'm stuck here and I can't do anything. <laughs> Nevertheless, you know me. I always have something in my mind, in case your grace's plan set to fail. Oh, I bet you have. My woman always has something up under her sleeve. Huh. 
And what's in that cunning mind of yours this time? Hmm, this is it. Wait, is it what I think it is? How did you get a hold of this? Let's just say I have my ways. With this, should everything go according to my plan, we will be able to get rid of not only the princess, but even someone else on the way. Afterward, we're going to get everything we wish for. Present time. I can't believe what Mother has done. She better stop her ridiculous Sohims, otherwise we'll have consequences, and I'll have to order her back to our estate. I'll make sure of that she won't harm Marinette. <sighs> that aside, I have to be even more careful from now on. If I were to show up as Chat Noir in front of the princess... Ugh. Well, princess, your dear husband is finally re Where is she? Turned. How uncanny. Could it be that she didn't wait for me and headed somewhere else? No. She must be here. She promised to stay here until I'm back. Besides, my conversation with mother barely took more than half an hour. Huh? She read it. Uh, why am I not surprised, though? <laughs> anyway, it seems like she really isn't here. I bet she was impatient and went back to our suite. At their suite. Mm -mm. Looks like she isn't here either. Princess, where did you go then? And why couldn't you wait? Maybe she's in our old room? Some minutes later. Hmm, something is definitely odd. I have a bad feeling. Huh. Princess, are you here? <sighs> what if she's out on her balcony and couldn't hear my knocking? Uh, huh? There she is, but what is she doing at the lake? In his old suite. Hmm. I know she's very fond of walking in the courtyard, but why would she go out in the rain? Something is not right. Huh? Marinette, watch out! Felix, how did he find me? Huh? In a coma? No, 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 no! Wait, what is... What just happened? <gasps> Burnin from Endeavor Agency texted me to get something, but I don't really understand it. So can you come shopping with me? Don't it say on the text? Oh, um, yeah, I can go with you, but what is it that you don't understand? The text says she wants me to buy Patissier Paris Le Anis Table Placier My Mongol de Fouf. How about you, Midoriya? Do you know? Wow, I really have no idea what that means at all. I think she's trying to ask you to buy something from the cake shop. Did you try searching online the first part of the name? I already did, but nothing came up. Patissier Paris Lanis Tablis Placier is the name of the sweet shop on a side street in front of the station. Marmogolo Hope is the name of the most famous Venice pastry. Mm hmm? Hmm? You guys don't even know that? Baka! Oh, well. Gonchon Sugoi! Ah, thank you, Baka Go. I am the best of the best! Awesome man, mean! Ah! Nice hair, shitty hair! My name is Kirishima. Shitty hair! My name is Kirishima. Ha! Ah! There isn't a single brain cell in them. OMG, now I have two himbos. Still, I love them both. Meow. So, this is not about us? Nah, man, chill. This is an old project. Ali almost forgot. It's about ship suggestions from a while ago. Then I'm not interested. Come on, Baku, babe. Love is love. Ew. That's a classic. What the fuck? That's it. I found it. It's comfy and me. No. <clears throat> Look. I have a cape. <sighs> oh, God. Somewhere in 10th Cap territory, an Osaram is working on something. Just gonna be ready soon. A little touch here. What a fuck? What's going on out there? Oh crap, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break! I gotta move, otherwise that person isn't going to make it! And test out my new baby. Please, don't explode again! Is that all you got? You slithering bastard! Damn it! <sighs> Bakugo, that's manly! Oh shit. <laughs> They look so different from our kiddos. You sap. But but look at them cats. They're so cute. I am. <laughs> Welcome to Riverdale. Thank you. Whoa. Oh my. Even better than when I read in my books. Cool. Oh, he is so, so beautiful. Who? Uh, Kiri? Uh, hmm? Oh, 
Hey, shitty hair. Oh my god. Dude. Kirishima, are you okay? Uh, guys, check out this funny meme. If I had a dollar for every pixel in this image, I'd have 15 cents. If I had a dollar for every ounce of rage I felt in my body after I read this text, I would have enough money to buy a cannon to fire at you. Actually, I did the math. Bakugo would have $225, not 15 cents. I'll kill you! Scary. If I had a dollar, I would buy a can of soda. Uh, while you're there, can you buy me some soba, please? Sorry, I only have a dollar. Oh. My friend Sheen is incorrect. Bakugo would have $22,500 because it's a dollar for every pixel, not a cent. Uh, awesome. If I had $22,500, I would buy a can of soda and soba. You can buy anything you want with $22,500. Yeah, and he wants soda and soba. Uh, soba to what? Directly to the forehead. Great. You know, I can get you free soba for life. How's that? All you gotta do is sign this paper. Um, personal space? <gasps> free soba for life? Yup, just sign here. Midoriya, your brother is kind. Uh, he's not my brother! I know the truth about you, Izuku. Uh, you were a quirkless, useless nobody before. But now you're a symbol of hope! Your hope could defeat any despair! I wonder what would happen if you died. Do you think people would fall into despair? Losing their symbol of peace, and then his successor too. I wonder whose hope will win! Shigaraki's hope, or Izuku's hope? Oh, an explosion quirk? How hopeful! This year, finally, I found the courage. Today, I'm going to my first Pride March, even if I chose one a bit far from UA. That's not very manly. But finally, finally, I'm here. Uh, is that... Bakugo? Hey! Sh shitty hair? Hey man, y you here too? What a, uh, coincidence. Yeah, I mean, I guess I was just passing by. Not a big deal. It's okay, I mean, I think I did the same. I decided to join the march where no one can really see me. But now that I met you here, Bakugo... Hmm? <gasps> Let's do this together! Let's hold hands, like we did back in Kamino. Like this? I feel I can do anything! Let's be proud, and never hide again. <laughs> hmm? So, I was thinking... You? You were like the moon to me. Huh? Yes. It may sound stupid, but... When everything is dark and I feel like I am lost... Huh? I just think of you and... And it's like a light in the dark. D does it make any sense? Ugh. You really are an idiot. Huh? C God, that's mean! Of course you are, Ajiro, because I'm doing great. I'm glad to hear this, man. You know, I kind of miss you. As if I care. Spoiler. Fuck. He cares. How the fuck did you end up in the fucking hospital? Are you even alive, shitty hair? You are an idiot. Bakugo, I'm okay. I just woke up. How dare you make me worry like that? I'm getting stronger, I promise. Please don't be mad at me, bro. Please say something. I'm sorry, Kots! <laughs> oh my god, Kots! She has your eyes! <laughs> you idiot! We have the same fucking eye color! And by the way, she has your damn teeth! Kirishima, I need to tell you something. That one time. In Kamino. I mean, I, I didn't really say anything after that. I didn't really tell you anything back then, but... But it was... I mean, what I'm trying to say is... Mwah. I... Da, da. N n you don't need to say anything. You saved me. I would do that again a thousand times for you. You are my sun. It's obvious that I am the moon. You know? The moon reflects sun's light. You're always cheering me up. You're always there for me. <gasps> it really fits your temple, El... Why are you crying? Gods! Gods! I love you so much! I love when you speak with your heart. Uh, I am not. See? You are free now. You, you stupid fish. Uh, what? 
Did we interrupt something? Oh, oh my! Why is Ariel kissing gods? <clears throat> Thank you, human. It tasted very good. Dude, WTF did we just saw? It's, it was definitely Ariel kissing Arkotsky. What a lucky guy. Oh, so he was Ariel's big brother. I told you it was not Ariel the merman. I don't think so. Uh, Arkotsky, you're always so lucky. I don't know. Oh, hey, Bakugo? Bakugo, dude, you okay? So lucky. Holy shit. I think I'm in love. See you, Katsuki. OMG. Kirishima? Kirishima? Hey, you there? Huh? Really? A Katsuki? Oh, uh, I see. He's like this since yesterday. He keeps babbling about a Ka something. Yes, that. Like the fuck is a Katsuki then? Dude, I think he's in love. My Katsuki is perfect. I want to see him again. See? Oh, I think he's cute. How the hell is him in love? Ew, gross. Pull yourself together, Kirishima. I want to see you again. Hold on. What now? You were telling me you started dating your dragon? No, the hell no. Come here. We are married. Oh, OMG. Snap. Quad blow above why? God, I caught a butterfly. Good boy. Oh, uh, what? Hidro, go back to work. Don't. Hmm. Yes. OMG, 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 what should I do? Is this his number? Holy shit. OMFG, he's hot. Please don't kill me. I, I was hungry and. Please. That's all my food. Please eat. I don't want to hurt you. Huh? And come here. I'm untying you. So you can move. Just wait a minute before start eating. You must get rid of that fishing hook or you won't be able to eat properly. <gasps> so, so much food. I need you to stay. St it's a plier. Now, please. What? Is that? No! If it's Vivi! Stay away, human! I knew you wanted to kill me and eat me! Uh, Kotsky, what the... Is that a... Hmm? Ariel? A mer... Snap? Ah! Hmm? Hmm? Kirishima, I can still see you. Um... What the fu- <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> no? At this point, why do I even bother? The stars of the show. Hey, Bakugo. Still here, bro? <clears throat> oh, wow. This is awesome. Uh, a little help here? Huh? Just stop being sexy. Hiroshima, put on a shirt. It's embarrassing. Ugh. 